Hi everyone. Um, I made this card tonight, um, so I thought I'd share it with you. Uh, I haven't really done much over the last um, week, probably because um, I've uh, had a busy, I had a busy weekend, and then it's back to work, and I've kind of had like near nearly three weeks off because of the Easter break, and a lot of our, um, a a lot at work didn't actually start back until this week, so. Um, probably feel a bit knackered this week um so this is what i made and i got the inspiration from this here in this magazine this back card here so i didn't quite do exactly like this but the inspiration was there and the general idea was there um <clears throat> this was the stamp set that i got with the magazine which i have here and I used this image here because it was the only one small enough to fit on my centre circle here. Um, <clears throat> so I used some of the eye candy um, paper by GCD because I have tons of it. And I just um, distressed all around the scallop circles and, and just the normal circles. And just punched out these little flowers and this one was already, <clears throat> it's one of these. Um, that was actually it was only like 99p for 24 of them and they're quite nice um, they're like the paper flowers so you can kind of spray them or ink them up or do whatever you like, emboss them um, so done these three little flowers added some um, rhinestones to them uh, added some rhinestones up here and down the bottom and added this Martha Stewart butterfly. I think it's Martha Stewart. I keep saying that every time I use it. Um, so that's what I made. It's blank inside. I haven't <coughs> done anything with it as yet. So that was my card for today. Um, <coughs> I also used my pearl markers to, to colour in um, the little the image. And I used my walnut stain to distress around the edges of the paper and the circles. I used this tiny little punch. Um, and I actually got that in a charity shop for like a pound. So, and it's <coughs> quite good because it, it kind of cuts through, um, you know, good cardstock. Um, flowers that I've shown you. And I used these. <coughs> Excuse me. And I used these. Uh, for the two um, four dies, two scalloped circles and two normal circles and like I said that I used that to stamp the image so that's my project for today um, I've got loads of ideas but just haven't got the time to start anything major at the moment and I've still got to finish the um, my kids albums I did actually get some of the stickers through that I um, had ordered um, I thought these were quite appropriate for um, like a kids album so I got some of them and what else did I get sorry I've got everything piled over here I got some of these um, I don't know if you can see them these uh, school stickers it's got the ABC and the report card and the test sheet with the calculator and pencil and this kind of little award <clears throat> so I thought that might come in handy I'm still waiting on some other stuff and I got this high school one um, to add to the album and I got some more stickers they're quite bright and leery um, the only thing is I don't really think about these when, when I saw them I thought oh yeah they'll be good and I realised they're all kind of pink and um, girly colours so <laughs> but I have got nieces um, so and I've got lots of pictures of them too when they were little so I'll use them too well I hope you're all having a good day and I'm going to do another quick video in a minute which will be separate regarding the um, UK and Ireland tag swap so if you're watching this and you're interested in, interested in, in, in joining and you're from the UK <clears throat> keep an eye out for the other video 
So I hope you're all having a good day and I'll speak to you all soon. Bye.